Alright guys, I'm back here with another tutorial. This time, I had you guys make, last uh, two videos ago, I had you guys make a server, spigot or bucket, and this is what you get right here. This time, I'm going to show you how to install plugins to your server. You could close that. I just renamed mine to tutorial server, make lots of sense. Then what you want to go do is open up your web browser, type in plugins bucket.org and I'll, I'll leave a link in the description below what the fuck is all this stuff what the poops was that guy naked okay then you can like just search up for anything what I let's let's see what I want I want to play a troll I really don't want it but it's just for the tutorial usually what you do is just down click the download button download Save file, drag it out, open up your server folder, plugins, and drag that in. But, who the fuck me a message? I don't care. Then, go back to that page. Then, if you want world edit, it is a way different way of installing um, the plugin. Click world edit, click the download button then click download and you can drag that out I don't know why mine shows as a raw file but you can still open it if it turns out to a raw file or you can just right click open with and then win our archiver not a raw file raw file sorry guys then you have to drag in this world edit.jar out you can delete this and go to your server file plugins and then drag that in then you can close this up then you can then you can start your server to make sure the plugins load you can exit this connect it to raw file you won't need it anymore then you can go to minecraft wait for everything to load and then it's gonna say done once it's done you can minimize that cause you will need it cause if you, pr if you press this X button remember it just doesn't save your world you can minimize that keep the server open then you can just go here multiplayer type in your server IP from and if you don't know it you can always go to your web browser go to google.com then you can type in my IP address. I'm not going to do it because I don't want to get DDoS. So then you can give that to your friends, not the people that you don't trust, only the people you do trust. Then what you want to do is open your server and make sure the plugins have worked. I don't know what the troll plugin is. So. But I do know the world edit one, so this one will be like slash uh, to op yourself. You need to go to the console, type in op, and then your name. I would have made that my YouTube name, but it was taken. Beanies. Then you can slash slash wand. You need essentials to do slash gm wand. I will I will be making a top ten bucket plugins later or something or top five. But then for now you can just slash game mode one and it's gonna take you to creative. The way slash slash one works is you can just left click, right click, slash slash set and any block. Diamond block is just diamond. To change it to diamond ore, I believe is diamond ore. Then try gold and then gold ore and all that stuff you could basically change it to any block and if you want the IDs you just gotta press F3 and H at the same time this will pop out then you can press F3 again and then look this is a normal thing then you can press F3 and H at the same time and it's gonna show you the ID so then what you want to do is just if it shows like 35 and slash 7 let's just do that so let's just set 35 um, colon and seven 
it will change to that block. To add more than two blocks, you could do such a set diamond, comma, gold, comma, iron, comma. For quartz, it's quartz underscore um under square, whatever that thing is, and then it'll give you multiple blocks right there. This is really good for making building faster and all that stuff. It's like a lazy plugin or something. Alright, so that's it guys. I will be making another tutorial on how to install the Insetuals plugin, top 5 bucket plugins, and how to make a normal vanilla survival server. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Like and subscribe this video. Share it to your friends. Favorite it. And yeah. I guess I'll see you in the next one. Bye.